Hey, what's up? Uh, today's video, we're going to be focusing on uh, how to sample into the OP1. Now, I noticed there's a few videos on YouTube already uh, addressing this topic. However, they confused me a little bit. So if anybody else ran into this uh, issue like me, I'm trying to make this video to clear it up a little bit. So when I first started to sample into the OP1, I watched a couple videos and there was a guy on YouTube that talked about um, backing up your sounds so you don't overwrite them. Um, I think he actually misled me to believe that I that you could possibly overwrite the internal sounds that come with your MP uh, OP1. Sorry, um, you can I don't think you can do that. I could be wrong, but let me demonstrate. So here we are with this sound. I like that sound, right? It's the chord sound in the sampler bank. Now you need to be on sampler in order to sample, right? And so here, I'm on this chord sound, right? And now I decide, all right, what's on the radio? So, so this is on the radio and I want to sample this, right? So I go to uh, radio. Alright, so now I could sample, right? I could sample Beyonce. Beyonce, it ain't so. Alright, so let me try to find a good part. Okay, so now we got that, right? Pretty cool, right? All right, I'm having a little too much fun. All right, so now you have the sample, right? And so now you go back to your bank, and you see it says sampler, it says chord, but you're hitting it, and you're like, oh no, Beyonce, I wrote over, I wrote over that cool chord patch, you know, sound with uh, with Beyonce. Why would I do that? I didn't back it up. Uh, relax. You actually did not do that. So here's what you do. So you tr you want to get chord back, but you can't. So, and then if you switch it, it's going to like disappear. And then you're like, where's my sample? So all you got to do is go to your bank, hit bank six, which is what you sampled it into, and hold it down. You know, this little clock will appear. And once the clock goes, it says check. Now, when you hit shift, you'll see this bank that's called snapshots. And that's what I believe those videos on YouTube were saying, make sure you have backed up. Because everything you sample goes into this little snapshot folder, and when you connect your OP1 to a computer now, then you could rename these, as you can see, I don't know if you can see the screen there, but as you can see, they're just titled numbers. So you could go and rename these, and edit them, and patch them out. They automatically uh, map out to the keys, but you could go and edit them, and change stuff up. And these are your own created sounds. So these are the ones that I think you might write over. But OP1 is so ready to go that you don't have to worry about like saving and you know and making sure your stuff's backed up because I don't think you can overwrite you know uh, the internal sounds that come with it uh, like in Decent, FM, Phase, all these different banks. Um, if I'm wrong about that, please comment and tell me, no, actually, you do this, this, and this, but I don't think I am. And I hope that that cleared up. If anybody was having that issue or that confusion, I hope that this video clears it up. So, you know, enjoy playing with your OP1. Let's hear some of the snapshots I have. All from shitty radio. That's a pretty cool one. You can make so much stuff just by sampling the radio. Let's see. Let's hear this one. Got it, love's 
special when I got it wrong, 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 special when I got it me. We heard that one. Anyway, hope that cleared things up. Enjoy sampling with your OP1. And don't be so afraid. Don't be so afraid of losing things. And uh, also, if you like this video, please like, subscribe, comment. Um, and as well... Um, if you want to support my music, if you like my music, I recently put out a record. You can go to flexunger.bandcamp.com and download my latest record for five bucks, 25 beats. Uh, it's called Porter Beat Service Volume 1. Uh, it has no beats from the OP1. I'm not up at that stage yet with the OP1, but uh, it all, it, all, that whole record was made with IMPC app. And um, the OP1 volume will be coming in months and months to come. Probably be like volume seven or eight uh, of Porta Beat Service. It's a series that I'm doing. Anyway, thank you. Hope that cleared things up. Like, comment, subscribe. Thank you.